Another uh, cultural piece before I move on to that technological piece is this idea of perfectionism and achievement culture. Um, clearly, you know, Maddie's decision to go to Penn instead of Lehigh in a large part was driven by achievement culture and was driven by what we can tell people we are and we often sacrifice who we really, how we might really excel and how we might really blossom for some outward uh, picturesque view of who we are. So like achievement culture, um, it, it's a term I know you guys know, but I, I think of it often as like this religion we've given our kids that if you achieve and if you succeed, that you will be fulfilled. And a lot of our kids believe this. A lot of our kids do believe that if you check all the boxes and you get to the school and then you have the career that's fulfilling, that it will fill like the inner peace of your heart. <laughs> that a lot of, in, in previous generations, and for a lot of communities still, like religion had played, you know? This idea of connecting to something larger and spirituality. Like we've kind of, for a lot of our kids, we've replaced that with just like achievement culture. And they grow up believing that achievement equals happiness. And a lot of them, if, they, if they're lucky enough to reach some level of achievement, they're kind of blindsided by the fact that achievement isn't happiness. And then they go through their own issues. Uh, about kind of recalibrate their lives, like, whoa, I got taught this lie. And now I'm trying to figure out who I am and what does make someone happy. Now I'm, you know, for a lot of our kids, they might be 23, 24, 25 before they're like, wow, my career's not fulfilling the way these, thing, these other things can be. So achievement culture and workism, this idea that we're, we're we starting to replace like religion with work. Work is supposed to be the fulfilling thing. I mean, I'm not advocating we all... Uh, it's not like I'm like a pro-religion everywhere, but I do think it's, it was serving a place in community and fulfillment that we've kind of moved away from. And I could see that piece of achievement culture that existed in Maddie. 